Last Saturday I purchased this uh, 991A, Yesu 991A, um, and wanted to broadband it or wideband it. Um, I looked on the you know, face tube and etc. so on and so forth, and there was very little information. Um, so I thought it might be worthwhile actually making uh, a video uh, for you guys or for anyone that wants to uh, broadband their 991A. So uh, yeah, um, it's not a particularly hard job, um, but it is a bit fiddly. You've got a lot of uh, case screws and the case to take off and face plate and the, the, there's a, a rubber washer, etc. so on and so forth. So uh, anyway, I'll, uh, I'll talk you through uh, how to do it, basically. You gotta be careful here. There's a couple of um, um, plastic uh, leaves that you lift up, and uh, they're not uh, they're not screwed down or anything. But uh, I can see them easily broken. So a uh, little pressure just to lift them up. Ooh, right. There's also a couple of um, Velcro um, fasteners that hold the power cables in um, and the the, uh, the ribbon cables also tend to be a little bit fiddly so uh, try not to uh, twist or break those as well. Damage any of these little cables. Now behind the face plate there's actually another metal plate that has six screws and the the earth or um, ground for the face panel is connected to the top okay. left hand uh, screw that needs to be undone um, and that will give you a bit of freedom to move the face plate out of the way um, yeah. so you can turn the uh, the, uh, the 991 on its side so that way you can get to the rest of the uh, the screws on the face plate Got to remove the uh, the rubber gasket first, and uh, again, be careful when you do this because it can pull and break the ribbon cable, or even take it out of the socket on the front. So uh, just a little bit of care needed. Be better off if I put it on its side actually. Not quite sure which side. Um, yeah, let's put it so it's uh, on this side because it's more likely to be quite very right for all of this junk. I love making this fiddly. Not difficult, just fiddly. Okay. 
as the beast. see this particularly well. So the one I need to short is that pair there. So, now it's my particular good angle, but we'll see if we can do it. You're not going to believe this, but this is a two millimeter tip soda nine. They are touched for about uh, one second. Removed, and um, hey presto. Doesn't have to be pretty, just have to work. And reassemble time, oh yeah. Just test. So no transmit. Okay, no transmit. So once you've done the modification, you'll have to reset the radio. This is done by holding then the fast button, the lock button, whilst powering on. This resets the uh, the radio, but you will lose all of the the memories if you've uh, stored any. Excellent. It be done. I was also incredibly impressed with the uh, the radio sound processing. The the DNR or digital noise reduction on this is outstanding. Really, it is. Thanks for watching. Um, that's how you uh, wide band a Yesu 9918. And uh, I hope that's uh, been educational and you found it uh, of use. Cheers for now. Thanks very much.